Well, hello, one and all. Uh, welcome to Arkansas Beer Reviews. Uh, up today, we are putting Mickey's Malt Liquor up against Heineken. I watched a video by uh, Ron by Louisiana Beer Reviews, and I can't remember even what the beer was. I, I guess it was Heineken, I think. Maybe it was Mickey's Malt Liquor. I don't remember now. I'm sure it was Mickey's Malt. Yeah, it was Mickey's Malt. Like, what am I thinking? Uh, and it was said that they was, I don't, they didn't say comparable, but they said uh, they had a taste in there that tasted sort of the same. And so I was just curious uh, myself and wondering if there's any resemblance at all. I guess that's what I was to say. Resemblance at all between the two. So, and I've been thinking about this wall, and so... Uh, this has been become one of my favorite beers, so and uh, decided to pick a six pack of these up and give it a try. See if there is any similarities between the two, or if they're just drastically different. Uh, I think they're going to be drastically different. I don't think there's going to be any similarities, but if there is, hey, I'll let you know. So here we go. Happy Father's Day. I am making this on Father's Day. Uh, my son from Brass, Bra 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 Brass Beer Refuse is on his way down. I got some uh, leg quarters on, the, on my Weber smoker smoking. So that's what we're doing today. All right. Alright, uh, Mickey's seems to be more carbonated, a little faster bubbles coming up. The color of them appear to be pretty close. The Heineken, I mean the, uh, the Mickey's may be just a little darker. The head of them look almost the same. I just have my spectacles out here. Head on this uh, Heineken is a little sweeter. Go ahead and top these off. Now the color, like I said, is uh, they're pretty similar. This the uh, Heineken's the, is not as carbonated as the Mickey's. The head are actually kind of similar. If you could see them, they look almost identical. A lot. Get the nose on them. Now this has got a little husky, watery on the nose. This is definitely sweeter, malty. On it. All right. Let's go taste. Cheers. I haven't had a Mickey's in a while. It tastes quite good. Sweet. Very easy drinking. Actually, tastes pretty good. This is a malty, sweet, actually has a little more hot presence on the finish of it. Mm. I can see where you would just taste them. They are maybe a little similarities in them. The Heineken is just a little sweeter. Uh, it's got a better nose on it to me. But, pretty close. I got just a little bit left in this can here. Alright. I'll tap my glass off so I can tell I ain't looking. I'm going to shut my eyes and give me, start giving these a little spin. 
Uh, I'm kind of curious uh, what these, what I'm gonna come up with. If I can really, if the Heineken's really gonna stand out or not. Excuse me. Hope I don't hit a crack here somewhere. Have to All right, there we go. Let's go ahead and nose them first. By the nose, I can tell this is the Heineken and this is the, the Mickey's. This has the that husky nose to it. This definitely has a sweeter, more appealing nose to it. I'm out. I almost paused it, on it, but we're gonna go ahead and taste it. That's the Heineken. And this is the uh, Mickey's and you know what I forgot to do I forgot to mark my stupid stupid glasses but there was one but I noticed I didn't say nothing but I was just freezing out this glass you can't tell it but some rough edges on it. I seen that at first, so to be sure and cheat, not cheat, that's the reason I pretty much why I did it the way I did. And uh, you think I would have thought to put something on it, but when I poured this, I said, oops, there's a scratch. I should have maybe got me an old glass when I poured this, the Heineken in here. Uh, but, I mean, it's kind of hard to see, but I can feel it and uh, see it as I really focus on it, so it's not as noticeable. With beer in it so this is the Heineken I know because I actually when I seen that and I wasn't going to cheat but that's like I said that's the reason I shut my eyes and twisted the glasses up and and I didn't really focus on the glasses that much to look for that but this is the Heineken it's sweeter smelled on the nose uh, has more of a medium mouth feel this has that husky kind of a watery nose on it not as 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 appealing the body of it's not as sweet uh and a little maybe just a tad thinner on the mouthfeel but it's not bad it's pretty good and i think the similar um, as i think as they warmed up you would see a drastic change in the flavors uh i don't, I don't know what it are right now they're if I was guessing, it's probably around 40 degrees or so. Uh, and you can also tell by the bubbles. As I also had, I had, I didn't just now thought about it, but you can see how the carbonation. I don't know if you can see it or not. How the carbonation is ascending a little faster on this glass uh, than there on this glass. And you know, I said the Heineken didn't seem to be it's as, as carbonated now saying all that there is definitely nothing I, if I had my pick I would pick the Heineken but there's definitely nothing wrong with this uh, it's a fine malt liquor like I said I haven't had one in a while and actually with the first taste of it I had just a moment ago when I first opened it uh, was quite enjoyable I thought that was not bad at all I was expecting something different uh so are they comparable well i don't think so uh they're both beers both have malt in them uh, this one have, don't have any adjuncts this one has adjuncts so in that aspect no, i don't say they're comparable it was really easy i didn't really have to think about it a whole lot uh, 
So I would say no, they're not comparable in my personal opinion. I think there's drastic changes, differences in them. Uh, to me, there is, anyways. So, anyways, hope you enjoyed this video. And this ain't a pick on uh, nobody kind of thing. I was just curious. I didn't think there was that much similarities in them other than they both are beers. Uh, they both have malt, water, and yeast. Uh, I think the, the biggest difference is uh, the quality of ingredients in the beers. So there we have it. Hope you enjoyed this video. If you're just passing by, hit that thumbs up. I mean, hit that subscribe button. If you enjoyed this video, hit thumbs up. Share it. Hey, and we'll see you on the next Arkansas Beer Reviews. Bye-bye.